Well, tonight here at Bulleye, we witnessed history as Pindari Express claimed back-to-back -back Cyril Rowe Bulleye Gold Cups, and he did it in emphatic fashion in front of a vocal crowd, reining in Turbo Thomas to claim the cup. Well, tonight Pindari Express became the first ever greyhound to win back-to-back -back Cyril Rowe Bulleye Gold Cups and the first ever greyhound to win the cup without winning a heat. Racing, first to hit terra firma was Turbo Thomas is going to lead Caviar Quality, Ebby Infrared, Chisels for the inside, run up to four, Bill Bath, then Burning Fuel, Pindari Express is midfield with Low Flying Crow, Tennessee Tiger with a lot of work to do and Burning Fuel is back at the tail, they're about to straighten and Turbo Thomas leads the cup field into the straight, Ebby Infrared chasing hard and here's the uh, freight train, oh he's going to go back to back, Pindari Express, he just drops on him late. Emotional and jubilant scenes greeted the Screws camp following the win and we spoke to Tracy after the race just to see how much it meant to her. Static. <laughs> Can't believe it. Fantastic. Yeah. Oh, look, it certainly does. Like, um, he's coming towards the end of his racing career. He's four in May and to beat these young dogs and, and to go back to back, I, I believe he's the first dog to go back to back. So, yeah, just unreal. Mm -hmm. unreal. It's not his, not his fastest time, but that was some run home, wasn't it, to get down Turbo Thomas? Yeah, it certainly was. Like, I didn't know where he was at the finish, but then I seen him, a dog motoring on the fence, and I thought, well, I think that's him. So I started driving him home, but I was hoping it was him. <laughs> he, it, this is his track, you know. I mean, he's got plenty of room to wind up, run him down, and, you know, I know he's not brilliant early. So, but, yeah, look, he, he is a magnificent dog. Um, means the world to our family. He's done everything for us, been the first city winner, the first group winner, first um, record holder and hopefully first stud dog, so yeah.